Hello and welcome again to my channel. I'm Robert McDermott, in case you didn't already know. And today we're going to be doing a quick thing I'm going to call Wednesday Wisdom, where I'm going to be discussing hopefully some little things that can maybe... I think there's a crack in my lens. Major false alarm. That is an extremely sketchy setup I have that on. Whew, back to what I was saying though. So yes, I'm gonna call this Wednesday Wisdom. I'm gonna wanna try and do this regularly depending on how successful it is. If people hate it, then why would I continue to do it? Though I do want to try and motivate people in some way, so I'll, I'll still be doing that, but it just won't be called Wednesday Wisdom. So yes. Today I wanted to be talking about the barriers that people set up for themselves and the excuses they let get in the way of their success. The thing about success is that to achieve it, there needs to be consistency. You need to work harder than everyone else. Always, you can't, you know, for some people, it means that for a few weekends, oh, sorry, that was a B. For a few weekends, I mean, heck, I spend most weekends in, you know, I'm 22 years old. I don't really ever go out drinking while most of the people my age, that's what they're spending their time doing, you know. I'm always studying, I'm always trying to find ways to give me the upper hand against my competition, which is basically everyone. Everyone is my competition for the most part, you know. If you're working with me, then that's a different story, but either way, I'm still gonna try and compete with you for fun, so what can you do? makes things more challenging for everyone. But yes, I'm 22 years old. I don't even have a job at this point. Um, I'm looking for one, obviously. So, as you can understand, I'm broke. But I'm still here, I'm finding places to shoot, I'm finding places to make footage, take pictures, everything. I'm not letting any excuses get in my way. I don't even have a place in my own home that I can sh privately shoot video. You know, like, look at this, I'm in some random place. I don't even know where I am right now. But I wanted to basically talk about why you cannot be letting things get in your way. Because obstacles are meant to be conquered. And if you just give up once you make it to the obstacle, you aren't even going to finish the race. So the main thing is that there is going to be failure. I have failed at everything I've ever tried. I haven't succeeded yet. But that's why I work so hard now. I work, try to work harder than everyone else because I'm all right with defeat because I only learn from each defeat. What's your excuse? What's your reason? I'm 22 years old. I don't have a job at this point. I have failed at everything. I'm a high school dropout. I don't have any sort of educational background to support me. I have no tr professional training. Someone, I haven't even had a person sit down and just try to tell me how to use a camera, I learned everything from YouTube and the internet. And so I don't see what your excuse is, why you aren't trying to do this yourself, you know? Oh, you're afraid people are gonna judge you. I can't shoot a video in my own home because I have to worry that my family or my parents are gonna m mess with me while I'm trying to do it. So go somewhere that you can shoot and do it there and stop coming up with these excuses. I'm just hoping that out of this, you know, I'm not saying that this is the formula for success by any means, but this is what I'm doing and what I'm trying. If you have a better way of doing things, feel free, say something down below and give me some tips and give everyone else some tips that is watching this video. Because we're all just trying to make it in the end, you know, we're just trying to finish the race. I don't even care what place I come in, I just want to finish the race. It's not about the battles that you lose, it's about the war. And if you win the war, then what more is there to do? You've achieved your goals. You have victory, you've made it to the top. But some people like me, I don't want just the top. I want to surpass it, I want to keep going. I want to bring others with me. And that's what you should strive to do as well. Because selfish intent is not going to get you anywhere. Today I have a question for you. When are you gonna start making a difference? And when are you gonna start trying to follow your dreams? You know, if you want to be if you want to be a filmmaker, 
but you're in school to be, I don't know, an accountant. What are you doing? What are you doing with yourself, you know? Life is about being happy. It doesn't matter how much money you have in your pocket, because in the end, we're all gonna end up in the same hole in the ground. So start worrying about the thing that matters and making yourself happy and also making others happy. Because the you that people knew yesterday can be a different person tomorrow. Some people change rapidly and it's a part of life. Change is good. You have to always be evolving and adapting and striving to be a better you. And with that, you also have to strive to try and help others become better versions of themselves. Don't try to change anyone, but maybe just if they need guidance, then give it to them. You know, advice is free. You can, you know, you don't lose anything from giving it to anyone other than time. And time may be valuable to some, but normally if you take your time and you give to someone, they will do the same in return. One day they might have something you need. So every day you should strive to at least maybe do one deed or maybe try to help someone else in some way. And I think that the world will be, be a much better place if we could just follow those rules. But yes, the main thing I wanted to just talk about today is I just wanted to try and push people. I want, you know, um, Cody Wayner. Cody, I hope you're watching this because you have definitely helped inspire me. I love the community you've started. And I think that everyone should strive to take place. You know, we aren't small creators. We are just creators, you know. it's We should be interacting with the community and we should be helping each other. Because it's selfish to just want to be at the top by yourself. I want anyone that's helped me get there to be there with me, whether it's a viewer, a random person, my friend, my family, anyone. You can't take all the spotlight for yourself. So every day, try to do something to maybe help someone else in some way. And tr I promise you by the end of the day, it will make you happier. I think that that is all that life is really about. Stop, stop letting excuses get in your way and stop setting your own barriers. Because you are the only one that is getting in your way. I hope this helped in some way. I hope that maybe I got someone to pick up their camera and start vlogging or filmmaking or taking pictures or maybe you're a skateboarder who hasn't gone out in a while or whatever you are, just start following your dreams. Because in the end, all that matters is that you're happy. Nothing else matters, money, fame, none of that. I can't eat fame, I can't eat money. Money may help me get, you know, money will help you get some really good food. But at the end of the day, what makes you happy other than doing what you want to do? So I hope that in some way, I've helped someone follow their dreams or maybe even make, take an extra step in the right direction, even if it's the smallest step. Thanks for watching and I wish you all the best of luck. Make sure to comment down below if this helped you. Like and subscribe. I really want to hear from everyone that has watched these videos. I know I don't have much of a fan base, but please just leave comments down below if I can even maybe just help you. Throw a comment if you're like, oh, I don't know what I'm doing with cameras. I will give you the resources you need. I'll send you in the right direction, anything. Just let me know. I want to help you. So reach out to me, reach out to someone you care about and start making the steps toward a brighter future. Thank you everyone, and goodbye.